Back in Forza Horizon 4, it is spring and today we are unlocking ourselves the Lamborghini Diablo GT R. <laughs> the Lambo Lamb <laughs> Lamborghini Diablo GTR. So the easiest way you can do this is by doing the PR stunts and the weekly Forza Thorn challenge that should give you the the highest and quickest amount of um, percentage, but <clears throat> if um, you can also do the championships as well, as long as they're one of the faster ones, like this um, um, S2 one, that'll probably be done in like 15 minutes, like I don't know, three minutes per race. No, oh, wait, no, that's nine then. It could be done in nine minutes. Um, so yeah. You can do that championship instead if you do not want to do either the one of the PR stunts because you can't or the weekly Forza Thorn challenge but the Forza Thorn challenge gives you the highest amount so it's worth doing that. So first one I'm going to start with the Forza Thorn challenge instead of doing the PR stunts because they go really quickly. Um, Forza Thorn challenge. Okay we need the Jaguar. Okay, do I have a Jaguar? There it is. I do! Surprisingly. I probably got that in the wheel spin, honestly. Okay, so it wants us to do dirt, ra um, dirt races, right? And I will tune it up to S1, I guess. Uh, what's it running? Hmm, yeah, why not? Uh, we don't need this. That just makes it look worse. Uh, let's go. Better tires. Hell, hell yes. Yeah, trees. Okay, um, boop. With. Uh, actually, can we change those? I don't like those. God damn it, why do the flowers keep coming into focus? What fits this car? I don't know. These look pretty good on them, I think. No. Ha. Huh. Well, let's. <coughs> I'll just put some. I'll put something on. Uh, yeah, these look nice. They're thin, they're low profile. Boop. Okay, brakes, yup. I want race suspension. Let's hope this doesn't put us over the edge. Ooh, that's close. I only just realized I put um, race tires on, even though I'm about to take this on the dirt. Okay, fully upgraded. I usually like keeping my cars either in S1 or S2. I, I barely have any cars in X-Class because there's no races in X-Class, so the only reason I have X-Class cars is to have fun with them. Okay, dirt trail, dirt trail events. Yep, okay, so these are the sprinty ones. Uh, sprinty, there's a sprinty, uh, dirt series, wow, my house could not be the furthest away from every single goddamn dirt race, we'll go to this one. Wait, I've noticed that my videos aren't completely in sync. Take the second exit. Now it's possible that I'm not running in V-Sync, but I am. Server. 
What? Okay, I'm gonna turn sh FPS back on. Yeah, look at that. Why am I... Hmm. Okay, I'll turn that off. V-Sync off turns it on. In 400 meters, you will arrive at your destination. I am confused. Okay, well, my videos should now be less... have less sync issues. Has anyone noticed that Forza looks a little different? It looks... the graphics look slightly better, but it's the view distance we have. It looks like we can see further away than usual. And they probably optimized it quite a bit too. Because obviously, if we could see that far normally, the game would be a little slow. I haven't played Forza in quite some time. This time it's over a week because, you know, uh, stuff came out, so... This video is probably very late. Oh, two days before our uh, thoughts of our playlist changes, so there'd be almost no point releasing this video, but I'm doing it because I don't want to miss one, and I had to be playing Forza because of those same reasons. Um, so, I've also been playing other games too because new stuff came out, so those games are kind of taking the place of my Forza time. Uh, Warframe got railjacked, so I've been trying to build a railjack still. Uh, getting resources in that game, especially the red one, takes some time to do that. Um, Graphic Order got a new heist that I've been working towards slowly. Uh, and Halo Reach came out. I've been playing that too. But that was a couple of weeks ago, I think. So all these games have kind of cut into my time when I usually would play Forza. But I should be playing Forza normally again. As in videos every Friday unless something happens again. Okay, that is one down. <clears throat> so how how do you think I can tell that this is um, Forza's been updated graphically? Well, when I used to play Forza maximum settings 1080p with VSync on, I would only use about 50% GPU utilization. It would tell me on the top right corner like it's doing now. Now we're hitting like late 60s and 70s just sitting here and when we started the race we were hitting 90% so they've done something very sneakily and this is probably because of the eliminator game mode, the battle royale because you need to see the barrier from a distance so they've changed some view distance stuff, that's what I think happened It was pretty noticeable because you can see the mountains much nicer now. Ah, uh, gotta love breakable barriers. One of the best things for to that is You have arrived at your destination. Okay. This one and then one more race and we should be on to the drive twenty miles. But and then we have to be able to reach 220 miles per hour and because I made it all-wheel drive I am not sure if we can do that anymore also I don't know how much 220 miles per hour is in Columbus per hour probably like 380 best guess
Oh yeah. Are we gonna get a drift pack? No, we did not. Okay. Oh no, are we going through the thing? The mud pickers thing? Oh god. If you did this in real life, this guy would take a beating and probably not work by the time you get out of the other side. <coughs> Maybe it might work. If we did that in real life. Hmm. Someone should just take a Lamborghini or something and just drive it through a similar um, situation like that and see if it lasts. Okay, we got one more race and then we can do the PR stunt to get ourselves that Lamborghini GTR. Lamborghini Diablo GTR, I mean. Our GPU utilization is just going nuts. Hold on, let's get back here. There we go. So it says we're just chilling out at 64%. But the game is just going absolutely nuts over here. On the top right corner. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is a fine race. I'll just switch to normal event. You know what I just realized? We basically just sat through a championship. So, doing this challenge might not be the fastest thing to do. You could just sit down and just do one of the fast championships, like the S2 one we have with Extreme Track Mode. We might rather just go do that one. You have arrived at your destination. <coughs> Oh, no! You ready for a great championship this spring? What am I saying? You wouldn't have signed up if you weren't. Did not mean to do that. Um, quit championship. No, quit championship. Okay, uh, switch to normal event. There we go. I'm gonna have to spend most of tomorrow just getting up to 80% because as soon as I complete this video, I'm gonna go play a different game. Really, I can't play a different game, I have to edit this video first. I think I'm gonna win this race. Damn it! Oh wait, no, now I'm catching up. Okay, never mind. Could. I could win. Come on! Damn it, we're on the road again! And he's still in front! Damn it! That guy was quick! Okay, let's try again. A Lamborghini Countach beat me. Hmm. Okay, let's go. We can be faster. I don't know why I was humming engine noises. I hope you didn't hear it. Okay, we are in fourth. I mean fifth. 
They're chasing down for us. Oof. Go down! God damn! <laughs> Man. Kai does not want to stop. Okay, hit the brake. Well, Kai has really bad brakes still. After upgrading it. Okay. Yes! We are now in first. Now we have to drive for 20 miles. Uh, yeah, 20 miles. We could probably do the PL stuff while we're doing 20 miles. Mm -hmm. Yay! I finished first. That's what usually happens. Okay, um, where's the first PR start? Hopefully this car is fast enough to do, fast enough to do that. Uh, we got speed trap, and we got speed zone, and we got jump. Let's go to the jump. We have to get 244 meters, and we can get a lot of miles done. Turn around when it's just safe. Ooh, why does the frame rate feel smooth? Turn right. I am topping out at 320. Jump! Whee! Oh, are we gonna land on the wheels this time? Yes! At the roundabout, take what is British Bulldog? Oh, records. Hold on. Yeah, I didn't check Fortsathon. Uh, sorry about that, guys. Let's check with Fortsathon. Ah, okay, nothing good. I'll just get that, I guess. What am I at? At 2,185 points. Okay, nice. I think the highest I got was up to like 3,000 maybe? Nah, I don't know that high. Still still probably 2,000. In 400 meters, turn right. Turn right. In 100 meters, turn right. You know, I still find doing videos by myself weird. Like, just kind of talking into a microphone. With, like, right. the imagination that someone is actually watching this video and Obviously, it doesn't happen often, and especially me making this video late, no one's gonna see this. That guy's really doing well now. Wow. Um, so yeah. Do people ever get used to talking to themselves, making videos? It just feels a little weird in, in some capacity. Like, I could probably produce better videos. If I was doing this with someone, like they were playing the game with me or something, Turn sharp left. and we would just be like, he'd be like, Turn I guess when it's just safe I would have to, to get so. a friend who's not particularly good at the game. So when I'm talking to him, it's like I'm talking to the audience and telling you guys how to unlock a tie. It would be the same as talking to him or whoever plays. So this is not gonna get 244. No. We need to do very faster. 26 more meters. We're gonna climb up this mountain. Okay, we are pretty far. We're gonna have to be precise. And not jump over about like that. Oh, God damn it. <sighs> What's the time? What's the time? Okay, now we're getting to speed. Jump over this. Not hit the fences, so I'm gonna have to go a bit to the left. I mean, right. Ooh, no. Too far right. 
about there. Ooh, gonna hit the fences again. We should get 244. Yes! Boosh! The one PR stop down. Actually, let's check how we're doing with this one. We've done 18. Oh my god, we're only like halfway. God damn. That's a whole lot of driving, and we're going to get 220 miles per hour. I'm going to just quickly. Um, shit. I'm going to Google this real quick. Okay, Google that we have to reach 354. This power only hit like 320. Hmm. I guess while we're trying to do the miles thing, we'll go on the highway and also try and see if we can get up to 354. Okay, we found the highway. I have understeered into the highway. Uh, let's go down the highway now, or up. No, we're going south, but we're going down the highway. Let's see what we can do without tuning. I just realized I didn't do, I didn't tune this car properly, that's why I've been having trouble by the way. Hmm. Okay, we're in sixth gear and we're at 300 now. And we're now in oncoming traffic. Just have to get 350. Come on. We can do this. I think we might need to do downhill. That's 340. Where did get? Where did get 354? I think that's what it was. So we got like 20 kilometers per hour left. And I can't shift up. On. Okay, I'm gonna turn this. Let me just get down here so we get a big funnel. Okay, yeah, it's 354. I got up to 328. Uh, let's see. Time to tune. Yeah, it's not the tuning. This is. Gears. It says we can get up to 356. If I extend that. To 350, I should. 359, okay. Yep. That gives us a lot of room. Get out of the way for transit. <coughs> oh, the trucks are back to normal. We don't, we don't see the illuminated thing anymore. We just did the forces on. Um, that means we are at currently at 49%. All we had to do is like one PR stun, which one was a fun one. Okay, what do we have to get? 249. Okay. We'll just teleport there because who wants to watch this video any longer? Not me. We have to get the goddamn Lamborghini to, and drive that around and see if it's good or not. A lot of people actually like the um, other car we got last week. What was it? The ATS? No. I don't know. I think it was the ATS. Apparently it's actually really good for S1. You just have to tune it correctly. Which I didn't do. Oh god, that is a hard turn. Yeah, that was close though. All we needed was like 13 kilometers per hour. This car can definitely do it.
Come on! Yes! No! What? Okay, you know what? Let's just... I'm gonna hurry this up and just pick a really quick car. This one. Never fails. Unless you drive like an idiot. Then you will always fail. We have to get three fifty. Bam! And there we go! We have unlocked the Lamborghini Diablo GTR. It took quite a bit of time. Unfortunately. I do apologize about that. Okay, let's get ourselves this new Lamborghini. Yeah. Where is it? Here it is, back. Hmm. Looks quite nice. Let's see how it performs. So it's an S2 class right off the bat. On the lower side, but that's pretty good. I like how everyone's basically driving a Toyota Supra. I do wish more Toyotas were added. Like the, uh, what was it, the AE86? Is it the 86? I think it is. Yeah, that would be nice. We could have, um, people drifting around playing Deja Vu. <laughs> We are already in 6th, 5th, 4th, 3rd, I want to sneeze right now, <coughs> fuck, oh these guys are quick, I'm not gaining. I don't think I am. Oh, never mind. I am. Oh, these are Mosler's too. Oh, God. How am I winning? Catching up anymore because I hit that goddamn brick wall. But we did get a 124 or 25. Let's check. We got 124. Okay. Yeah, we can definitely improve this car. So this car is gonna be most likely max S2, and it'll probably be real quick. Duty Festival. I have played the Eliminator, but I have not won at all. It's embarrassing for me. Yes. Okay, so this car's probably going to be old. Oh, it's real. Okay, I'll give it real drive there. Uh, Racing V12. I'll just leave it stock. Put a twin turbo in it. Hmm, I don't know why you would want to remove the wing. That probably sounded like a lot of mumble. Um, yep, thick rears. 
lighten these guys up. Let's go. Race clutch. Race everything. Better brakes. Oh god, that weight reduction. Whew. Ah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but, yeah, but I can't do that. Um. Yep, let's just upgrade these then. Okay, apparently can't keep the stock engine. Where, how far can I get it if I just push these to the max? Okay, yep. Not very, uh... We'll just put... Uh, we'll just put a V12 in it, not the racing one. Yep, let's do this now. I did forget to put a turbo in it. I'll go and fix that. Boosh. Apparently this turbo might give us 40... Ooh. Might, actually. Boop, boop. And... There we go. That's Max S2 and rear wheel drive. So it's mostly a Lamborghini GTR. Um, yep, seems fine. I'm not really good at tuning, so I, most of the time if I'm tuning a car, it's based on what I usually like. Which helps. What I usually am able to drive with, that's what I do. But this car seems to be really stable for rear wheel drive. You don't get many rear wheel drives that don't wheel spin out. in six and fifth and we're in fourth now third and now in second oh this car feels really twitchy too Oof. now now we are in first and I've hit that wall like the Usual. This would definitely not be a perfect run. It would be flag in rivals. Okay, and go around this corner. And boom! One minute seventeen. This car actually feels pretty good, but even in rear-wheel drive, I'm I don't even want to do all-wheel drive honestly. If it runs this well, honestly, the only reason you have to do all-wheel drive is to make the car stable for high-performance vehicles mostly. That's why a lot of people do this. Um, and occasionally some cars can't get to max this too if I'm becoming all-wheel drive converted, so you got that. But this is a car I like in rear-wheel drive. It's stock drivetrain, and it's really good. I definitely recommend getting this car if if you um, watch this video. It's a recommendation. Sorry for the late upload, though. I'm gonna go quickly take the screenshot for this video. But I will see you guys in the next video. And what happened to my glass? Don't remember it looking like that. Okay. Photo time. Wait, what happens if I reset cosmetic damage? Nope. Okay. Why is it so bright? God, did I do it photo at night? Okay, we'll do this. Uh. 
Effects mode, exposure is really high for some reason. We're in a day, so I'll drop it down to 55. Yep, brightness seems okay. Which is fine. That was me cracking my knuckles. Sorry. That picture looks blurry. Okay, let me just fix that. Go to panning. And just manually set it. Until it looks clear. 33 seems like and then do that Boop. so sometimes if you can't you know get the car to look good when you're fo manually focusing it by pressing X just switch to panning and then change the focus and you should be good uh, Diablo GTR Current car scenery filtered. There we go. And there we go. We have ourselves the Photoshop. Uh, what? Okay, I'm losing my mind. Uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.